Gilead News. I'm Pelly, bringing you your news here from Mount Gilead. On Sunday evening, the 12 Kilt Ones came to camp, and boy, did they have a journey ahead of them once they got here. On Tuesday, June 23rd, at 10 a.m., they embarked on their kilt trip, canoeing down the Delaware River for four days straight. It's been said by past kilt classes that the canoe trip is a formative experience and really brings them, them closer to nature, themselves, and God. With such a large kilt class of 12 girls, they had plenty of experience to go around. Let's just say that some of them won't want to go canoeing for a few weeks though. But hey, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. That's what Friedrich Nietzsche, a German philosopher, said. Then Kelly Clarkson wrote a smash hit in his honor, I think. Anyway, let's check in with Tori on the weather. Tori? And then there was a dance battle at my cousin's bar mitzvah. <laughs> oh, oh. Thank you, Addie and Kelly. It's Corey here, and we are coming live to you from Scranton. Scranton is actually one of the uh, world's safest cities to live in. Um, and you can enjoy the parks and the rivers, and it's just a lovely place to live. And I'm going to be reporting about the weather today in um, Scranton. It's funny. I feel a little boozy. <laughs> Must be me. Um, oh, hello. <laughs> Well, I don't, I don't know what that was about, but um, nothing to worry about. It's actually very beautiful here. Um, it's totally fine. I, 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 the city is beautiful. And I, I'm doing it. Oh, okay. It's just, you know, 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 it's just, you I think we should be concerned about this. No? Okay, probably not. So, as you all know, camp has sadly been canceled this year. However, Bertha has decided to live at camp this summer, and she is here to join us today. Hey, Bertha! Hey, 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 hey! Oh. <laughs> Does anyone smell that? It smells like the great outdoors. My yeah. favorite. Mm. Thank you for so, having me. I'm thrilled. I, uh cleaned up for this actually really you got yeah. some mud on your nose oh that's um nature's makeup yeah oh, interesting yep. so bertha um you've been here for a couple weeks now mm -hmm. what have you been doing around camp oh just the typical camp things um cleaning out the uh chicken coop yeah. um identifying uh animal droppings wow. around camp so we know what kind of animals are on i collect them um and organize them by hand um also you, um, i hope you wash your hands um i rinse them off in the stream before coming on here yeah stream is clean clean water um and uh shoveling out the um all the horse poop in the corral, oh. corral. yeah wow sounds like a very interesting job so it's do you stuff. like the horses no not at all uh horses scare me um but actually last night um i i just find them as equals um so i decided to sleep in one of the horse stalls with them um, oh. just to get a sense of who they are um, as an animal. Um, and just, yeah, I just nestled right in there. And uh, yeah, it was a good time. It was wow. great. Do you sleep well? Um, yeah, actually, most nights I sleep on hay outside. So this was actually kind of a treat for me. There was a roof over my head. Wow. <laughs> I did miss the stars, though. Oh, yeah. 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 So what is your favorite thing about camp here at Mount Gilead? Um, there are no requirements or expectations of being clean. That's I, not true. I, well, um, each to each their own. Um, I can choose to um, bathe or not. Um, I, you have to bathe. Mo you have okay, well, okay, listen. Most of my baths um, are in the pond. You're kidding. No, they're in You're the pond, kidding. and I, I've made my own soap out of clovers, um, and I just rub it on there. The algae kind of um, takes some mm. dirt off, too. That's disgusting. Yeah, it's great. How do you wash your clothes? Um, I don't typically wash my clothes. Um, I usually wear this um, to bed and all throughout the summer, one outfit. Um, but when people, when I start to smell, um, that's when I know it's bad. And I just jump in the pool on Monday nights during all camp swim. 
um, and the chlorine just cleans me right up. And then the smokiness of the fire afterwards, it's, it's a real crisp dry. Um, yeah, of my clothes and my hair, um, it's the smoke that really gets it. Um, and that kind of gets, gets me going, um, fresh and clean for the week ahead. Yeah. Why don't you use the washing machines? Um, mold, that's all I'm gonna say. Unnatural mold. So you never like go and shower? No. You know, cause we have really nice showers in the cabins. Yeah, those are beautiful uh, for sure. I just, as a principle, don't um, use water that's over 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Um, that's just a me thing. But the showers are beautiful. Great job. Yeah. Well, um, thank you for joining us You're today. You're welcome. <laughs> well, from everyone here at Mount Gilead, have a great day. See you next time thank on you. Gilead News. Thank you.